Hello everyone. In this lecture, we will uh, try to learn a C program for counting number of lines, words and characters in the given uh, strings, right? Uh, it may be a string or set of lines of, uh, in set of lines of uh, information, right? So for that, uh, Yes, I had used here Konya, but it is not mandatory. You can skip this uh, Konya.h. Uh, right, hash include stdiver.h and then starting with my main. And then I took a character uh, array, str of size 200 and uh, i, a variable, line, a variable, word, and ch for characters. And for all of them, I was initializing its value to zero. Right, I'm asking user to enter a string in multiple lines and it has to be terminated with this symbol negation symbol right and uh, yes and uh, here scan f so whatever the thing string values you are giving that one will be stored and it should be ended with the uh, uh, negation symbol so that is how you will be given here right so this uh, symbol indicates that it will be going to new line and it will be ended over there next to count number of lines in the text so what I'm trying to do here is first you'll be counting number of lines, number of words and number of characters. So what we are doing for i is equals to zero for the first time, str of i is not equals to null, right? str of i is not equals to null, that is for the first time. Then what you'll do, you'll check out the condition. If str of i is equals to new line, obviously first you'll have a character which is not equals to new line. So your line will not be incremented. Your word will not be incremented. You'll come for the else part and you will check out uh, is there any space for that or any tab or any new line. So obviously for the first character, you don't have anything. So what I have to increment, I have to increment the character. So you will come to this part else ch plus plus so after uh, then again you what will happen you will come back again for your for loop you will increment the i value that is for the second character you will read you'll check whether it is equals to slash and no then uh, if it is equal then you will increment the lines and words if it is not else so if this condition is false again you'll check else if condition whether it is some space is there or some slash t tab five spaces or some new line is there if it is there then you will increment the word and character if not else if else you will be incrementing the character so if i give like um, hi space welcome if i give so first two letters i will give no so that one will be character incremented and again space whenever the space will come what will happen it will increment the C. It is not equals to slash and so you will come to this else part and you will check. Yes, I had given one space. So that time what will happen? Word count will be incremented and also the character count will be incremented. So like this within the loop, just if slash and is there, then you will increment the line count and word count. If uh, space or slash t or slash n is there then you will increment the word count and character count. Else these two conditions are not false. Simply you will increment the character value. Right, so this was a very simple program, which is also very, very important. And finally, you are trying to print the characters, words, and then lines. And the one thing you have to remember here is you need to give this symbol, this negation symbol, after giving all multiple uh, lines of text, you should go to the new line and then you should terminate that particular text. Okay, so very simple and also as I said, it is very, very important for your theoretical exam also. The simple logic is you should just remember uh, this one regarding um, that connection, uh, sorry, whether that string is equals to a new line or it is going for the word increment or for the character increment. So if you'll just check out that one, it will be very simple, sim simple to implement. Okay. So now let us compile this code. Let us compile this one and we'll check it out. Yes, compilation, no errors. Let us run the code. So it is asking enter a string in multiple lines and terminated with the uh, negation symbol. So I'm giving hello. And in the next line, I'm giving welcome. To, and in the next line, I'm giving previous lab. Right. And in the next line, I have to give this negation symbol. 
see there so character count is 22 word count is 5 total number of lines you had given is 3 so here when you are trying to uh, count for the characters it will also count all the spaces also right so if there are uh, uh, so I, I think I had two spaces here welcome and two and pps and a so I'll get two uh, additional values so overall numbers are 1 2 3 5 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, uh, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. By adding these two spaces, it is 22. Right? So, this is what uh, the counting of number of lines, words and characters in the given text. Right? So, that's all for this video. I hope everything is clear. Thank you all.